the next question from Muhammad Adil India. My father left me when I was 18 years old and I had no one to look after me. My mother left me when I was 11 years old. I stayed as a paying guest and worked to survive. Today, Alhamdulillah, I earn good amount of money to feed myself. Now, father asked me to give money to him on monthly basis, which will be around five to six thousand rupees per month. Should I give the money to my father as my father didn't take care of me? The brother asked the question that his father left him at the age of 18, mother left him at the age of 11, they did not take care of him and now he's got a good job, he's earning good money and father is asking monthly approximately five to six thousand rupees, should he give him or not? I do not know the reason why the father left you. But even if I agree for the sake of argument hypothetically that he did not take care of you. If he did not take care of you, and if he did not do his duty, that doesn't mean that you should not do your duty. You, as a good son, should do your duty. And taking care of the parent is a requirement that every human being, every Muslim, should take care of the parent when they grow up. And Allah says in the Quran in Surah Fusila, chapter number 41, verse number 34, that repel evil with good. You may never know that the person who is the enemy will become your friend. And here, your father is not your enemy. He is your father. I agree with you, he did not take care of you. But you have to do your duty. And if you do your duty, inshallah, you will go to Jannah. So according to me, if your father is asking for five to 6,000 rupees, I would say that give him 9,000, give him 10,000 rupees. Give him more than what he is asking, if Allah has given you. If Allah has not given you, and if you can afford 5,000, give 5,000. Or if you cannot, yet you sacrifice your luxury and give money to your father, Inshallah, you will be doing a great deed of charity. And especially if you are doing to your father, it is your requirement, it is your duty, it's your fard. So my suggestion to you is that if he is asking for five or six thousand rupees, give him much more, give him ten thousand rupees. Inshallah, that will benefit you in this world as well as the akhirah.